need to... Oh god, chaffs. Chaffs. Hmm. Chaffs. Right, start with a wizard and then look at the team. Pupok. Hmm. Oh my god. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Hmm, tricky, tricky. Plus strength blocker. Both block break tackle. Claw palm. Only claw by itself, not very good. Claw my bow, pretty good. Carrier, bludge, sure hands. Twenty eleven four. Maybe go Apple Apple Wizard. No, you already got the wizard. Has he only got eleven players? He's got 12 shit two dirties no I'm not gonna I'm not gonna concede or anything mm, tricky 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 no no way am I gonna concede no no chance his team isn't that scary it's one core now obviously he might get lucky. He might get lucky. The claw might be low can tear through my team. Without you know, without like the claw the claw might be low can get lucky and tear through the team. The claw pom can can not get not need to get lucky and tear through the team. But on the other hand, he could just push push around and not do a lot, couldn't he? Yeah, thirteen two two is a fine score, yeah. Maybe I should have got an extra peasant. Could could have got a Merc peasant without seventy K. Yeah, he's not bad. He certainly knows how to play. He's won he's won the champs ladder, I think, hasn't he? Did he win it last season? Was that Pupok last season? <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's true, Skoro, yeah. One, two, three, yeah, he's only got three guard. Got four guard. Hell can't be cool, yeah. Yeah, they're, uh, they're going pretty great. To be honest, wow. Oh, they were going great. <laughs> mm, he's letting me blitz him. Oh my god, and I even get to use fucking Fend as well. Yes, exactly, Wormthrax, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so like, not only am I not in contact, it also puts him on the ground and his only option is to blitz. And then, so yeah, it's just great. It's a great uh, move, isn't it, really? Like, it's obviously a bit shit to expose the guard peasant, but on the other hand, um, if I uh, put him there and power him, he, or his only, the only guy he can blitz is the, uh, is the fucking uh, peasant guy, so... Pretty good. Nice. 
Mighty Blow on the Strength 4. Maybe Mighty Blow on the... Uh, no, but and it's... He hasn't got guard, so you again using the guard, but then I could put a guard in here. So I could have the mighty blow on him. So guard goes in there, he gets a 2D, thanks to this guard and that guard. And then, yeah. Shit. Okay. <laughs> it was his claw bomber. <laughs> Brilliant. Although it fucks up my blitz, but still. It's still funny, isn't it? It fucks up the LOS hits as well because I don't want to put the guard in there anymore. forward one two three four Exposes these a bit, doesn't it? But I'd rather. Hmm. I mean, I could hit him with wrestle, but it's just really shit if I get the both down. Then isn't it? Instead of quite good if I get the both down on him. Herp, derp. Base, base, base. This will fail. I am on the right. No, the peasants don't. No, I just rolled a double on it. That protects him a little bit. He's got to go there to guard against the uh, bull hit, hasn't he? That's a pretty good. It was a pretty good uh, rock, obviously, to keep him down. But I would have rather mighty blowed and killed him, but still. <laughs> nah, nah, yeah, there's no way I'm going to concede early. Like, if he, if he hammers me, you know, and uh, and there's no there's no chance to win, I'd consider conceding. But I'm not going to do it before the game's gone badly. Yeah, this is the bad thing. By getting that hit, he's got the 75% knockdown on armor 7. So I didn't like, didn't like getting the, uh, that peasant in there. Nah, Necropotence. Fouling thick skull players is pretty shit. He has two kick of death, yeah. And now he's still, he's fouling him from, he's protecting him from the peasant foul. Uh, and obviously I'm just going to run away from him because I'm scared of him. <laughs> Hitting him. Oh, he's giving up blocks. Madman. Hmm. Fuck off. <laughs> We've both got guard. Oh my god, I didn't bring the fucking... Oh my god, I'm an idiot. 
What I hate is when I think of things and just don't fucking do them. Like I thought, this guy can come over here and that and 2D him and that and blitz him. And just fucking didn't do it. That was horrible. Mouse doesn't work properly as well. <laughs> Do you have a claw mighty blow hit? For fuck's sake. You can double GFI to hit him at the moment, which is pretty fucking scary, isn't it? At least that makes it a bit trickier having to come this way and stuff. This one day I was fine with doing. Alright, good. Leaders used his reroll so might as well go there to protect uh protect that guy a bit. <sighs> oh that was really dumb not moving that guy there first. Holy shit. Cost myself a reroll. I mean, I can imagine that that it was the the one dice block on the uh, on the on the bull that, that it happened with because that's something that I was fine with using the reroll on. So there you go, guard giving him his two D. I was okay committing a reroll if I'd sculled on the on the ball. So yeah, he's going for the hit on him. It makes sense. So there you go, guard, guard. In fact, getting him the two D. So he's double GFIing to two D. Yeah, he can get forward, especially if he piles on. But I mean, he does have the break tackle bulls, which are pretty hard to defend against. Yeah, it's all right. But that's a lot of skills, isn't it? That's the thing, Necropotence. Like it's 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 what like a dark elf lino would get to eventually. assist foul. That makes sense. He's on a seven. Dirty player. Fair enough. Lucky bastard. No send off for him, of course. One, two, three, four, five, six. GFI, GFI. One dice him. Two dice him. Get the guard in. Two dice him. One, two, three, four, five, six. Geophyte hit him with tackle. Base, base, base. Oh no, I stood where I was going to blitz from. Oh god, I'm so bad at Blood Bowl. So fucking bad. 
I moved the wrong garden. Oh, oh no, what's this? What even is it? I moved the wrong garden. Now I'm blitzing a good dodge guy without fucking wrestle or tackle. Oh well. Roll pushes anyway. I'm not lucky they're only KOs. No, not really. <laughs> yeah, the AG2 is no prop, no bother. Yeah, I got four, but just getting forward doesn't do a whole lot for me, does it? The claw mighty. Yeah, it's only turn three. It's just on the ropes instantly. I mean, only down two players isn't that bad. But it's just scary, isn't it? Because his tackle stops my agility three dodges pretty hard. And he's got claw pump and claw mighty blow, so it's pretty scary. I definitely don't want to score quickly. Um, this is why I don't like what I've done here because it's getting me into the point where that's all I can fucking do, isn't it? Looks like I'm going to get two on grinded, but then there's the chance, obviously, with a wizard of getting the turnover. It just, oh wow. He stacked the GFIs. That oh, pays off. <laughs> if I even can. Doesn't Palace? Outrageous. <laughs> right. Maybe I haven't forced myself into an early score. I mean, two stuns here and two guys down is bad. But I could just block him and then serve him, couldn't I? One dice. I was a fucking legend. A fucking legend. Cunt! Never lucky. <laughs> Fuck's sake, man. Never go for the surf. No surfs. It's on the fucking sheet. And I did it anyway. Do I re-roll that? That's the question, isn't it? Yeah, but I should have just tried to score, shouldn't I, I guess? Obviously it wasn't going to work. Um, I mean, he's not core pumping this turn, which is it makes it a good turn. He's, he's, he could, maybe he's mighty blow with him, so he can push him and then get core mighty on the ball. Mm, hard to assist him though. question is if I re-roll this. Now, of course, I'm only going to have to re-roll this one in three times. 
Yeah, but it would have been worth it if I'd surfed him, wouldn't it? <laughs> that's the that's the horrible thing. Like the the payoff was too much to surf his ball, wasn't it? Um, and I wouldn't be in a good spot wherever I was. Like you know, saying that I put myself in a bad spot. He's still got what two guys on him, three guys over here. He's still he's got like six players over here, like. And it still seems bad just because I've got two guys stunned and two guys KO'd. There was no there was no good position for me here. Um, it, uh, yeah, I want to go here, but it's uh, it's whether I'm going to spend a reroll to get there, isn't it? And unfortunately, I've got to think for two minutes before, rather than just rolling it and see if I roll a one or a two, because it gives you 15 seconds. I hate that. I really hate that. Down to one reroll if I if I reroll it. Pretty easy for him to get two dice on the ball, though. So I guess I'll do it. There you go. Down to one reroll, six eight. It's just too easy to get two dice on the ball, though, isn't it? That's the problem. No. He can punch me into the claw. Fuck, 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 fuck. <laughs> oh well. It was a nice idea. <laughs> yeah, I think I had to get in there. It was too easy to too nice the ball. I bought a bot. <laughs> I just realised, fuck, he's gonna punch, punch me in the claw palm. Fuck. <laughs> that was good, that wasn't it? Only getting the push there. Yeah, it was a well spent reroll, yeah. No, no, but I'm just sad about the, the, the fact that the game only gives you 15 seconds to make your mind up. That's the, that's the problem, you know? What it should be is I should be able to click on the move and then use the remaining two minutes of my turn to decide whether to reroll after the one in three chance happens. What I shouldn't have to do is think for two minutes before about if I roll a one in three, what do I do? You know? Oh man, I really can't, uh, can't do anything there, can I? Wrestle tackle. Can't surf him. One, two, three, four, GFI, GFI. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. He can base the ball, but he's got break tackle anyway. One dice him. Can't hit me with with tackle. Thing is, I want to go here and then base him and then block him, don't I? That would be the thing. But it's hard because it's like a three plus 
4 plus 4 plus. Incredibly difficult. I'm going to use my Blitz. Could just one dice him, but then I don't have to use my reroll on it. He could dodge out, then he could move, then he could block him. <laughs> you can't still can't can't blitz though. I nearly did it. You did the the first three and the four. <laughs> I've got no idea when the season ends, actually. That's the, the disappointing thing. Oh, yeah, yeah, that was actually wasn't that bad, was it? Mm, yeah, it did enough, actually. Now he's got to do like something. Ooh. He's just going to claw up on the leader, isn't he? Probably. Oh, this, is, this is stopping the stall, isn't it? <laughs> um. Getting a claw palm on, on the leader and a claw mighty on the other guy. That's completely stopping the stall. Ninth of May. Does it? When did it suddenly start on like the fourth or something? Are they shorter seasons for the World Cups? Dirty dingo. If he doesn't power me, I just score. I'd have taken the ball down if I was him. So at least I'd have had the. At least I would have had to roll the score. Both KO fails. Brilliant. Brilliant, brilliant, brilliant. Three turns, might be able to defend it. Sorry. When did it start then? It started about the 4th of April, didn't it? That's a very short season. Yeah, April the 4th is when it started. 
Fuck. I didn't realise it was such a short season. Holy shit. Not so easy to go turn it up though. Mostly I just want to uh, hit that guy. Yeah, blitzing right and going for the ball was a nice idea. Especially as I've got the wizard. It was, it, it's what I wanted to do was to blitz right and go for the ball. But at the end of the day, um, I still got two turns after this. So I don't have to go crazy for the ball. But it would have been good, wouldn't it? It would have been good, obviously, to flood the black field. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and get behind him. But then that an overcommit on the blitz could be a disaster. So I don't want him to double GFI in. But this is a good place to stand. <sighs> no, because it just makes it easier for him to score. It's not easy for him to score in three turns, you know. So, yeah, this is the last chance ladder has come for that, yeah. That's true. If you get the top four, you qualify anyway, so. Shit. No, I didn't really want to just, like, commit like a lunatic. Because then then it just gives him the easy breakaway. And at the moment, the score isn't easy for him. I mean, I know he's up two player, well, one player actually, because I had a reserve. Maybe he should be in cross one. Mm -hmm. Fed not doing a lot then, is it? Like ultimately, I want to prevent the touchdown rather than score, don't I? I know, like I know, the lizard man game was fun, but uh, it's a bit of a different situation than that was. Yeah, top four qualifying next season as well. Yeah. But like, if you get in top, like, it's weird because this this season counts for the invitational. But of course, if you get top four, you don't need you don't get in the invitational because you've already fucking qualified, haven't you? No. Oh so reroll used before he's even gone for the pickup. Glorious. Glorious. Bastard. Fucking bastard. Didn't even move his fucking... Didn't even move his hobgobs forward. Oh. oh, He's only got one scoring threat then. I 
Ah, oh, three turns. Oh, he's got sure hands. He's got sure hands in this three turns. All right. <laughs> All right. Ignore. Ignore everything I said. <laughs> um, ignore everything. All right. These can get punched. He can stand up. He can one dice. Reroll gone. Great. At least his reroll's gone. He could dodge one in nine to get away. Then could 2D him. And then he could try and dodge to guard there. That's probably better than a one in six into a 2D on him. Ah, oh, you bastard. Guess I should have dodged there, actually, if I fell over. Should have dodged there, shouldn't I? He doesn't have dodge. <laughs> he doesn't have dodge. <laughs> That's the problem with having having four positionals that are all blodge, is when one of them doesn't have blodge. <laughs> I've twice made that mistake with this team, thinking that the fourth guy had dodge when he didn't. Probably do it with Dark Elves as well. But yeah, it worked, so never mind. It was the wrong player though, should have one diced into a 2D. The other way. Oh, he's got two GFIs to score, hasn't he? Or a handoff. I guess he's gone for two GFIs. Yeah, I've, I've, I, yeah, no, I, it's, I'm not blaming, I'm not blaming the game. It's definitely my fault, 100%. Chaos Dwarves aren't OP, they're, they're strong. And like, they have some matches where they're really good. But they're a bit difficult to get off the ground. Obviously, once they've got break, tackle, block on their bulls, they're pretty fucking amazing. But I don't think they're OP at all. Should do both GFIs this turn, shouldn't he? So at least he can score with a bull if he if he fails. Now two GFIs. Could bolt. Maybe I should have tried to get the uh, canoring threat for the bolt. One dice pushing him works on a six. Which doesn't seem like very good, does it? <laughs> a three plus five plus is slightly better than a six plus, isn't it? Because it's more than half. Like if I base him, 
then that's over three plus five plus is, is over half of a six plus, isn't it? Shouldn't use the reroll last time. I don't want to use my bolt just to avoid the score. I'm going to use the bolt to turn him over. So I could, it could be 1-1 one, one here, and then I could use the bolt to turn him over and score. This is really unlucky, failing both KO rolls, by the way, just just quietly. I could block him. I could 3 plus him, and then 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, get guard in. Three plus him, two to him, and then get guarding. Is that better than a right? So the three plus five plus is twenty-two percent. What if we get a three plus three plus, and then a two dice with two successes? That's twenty-five percent. So that is actually better to do the other three percent, the other three plus as well. Oh, but there's also a two D where anything twenty-four. So it's best to make it a two D. All right, I've got loads of time. All right, so it's better to do this one dice block and then this two dice block, then get the guard in. So. No, oh, but it only works in the five plus, doesn't it? Does it? If I push into here. One, two, three, four, five, six. Shit. Maybe it's not worth it. Maybe it's just better to do the... Oh, I could, uh... Could make a GFI. That might make it worth... Worth... Worse? Oh, well, fair Nah, I've stunned him up. You could just get killed by him, couldn't I? I mean, okay, he's going to hit this guy instead, but you would have just moved this in to stop that. I guess I could have stood him up and punched him. That would have been better. Yeah, rather than just standing up, I could have stood him up and punched him. That's probably why I should have done it instead of getting pommed, shouldn't I? I guess I should have done that first. I guess, oh, yeah, this one, so he couldn't three dice. Yeah. Yeah, stopping three dice would have been all right, wouldn't it? <laughs> yeah, because he might have just pushed him. I might have got a boat down. Ah, oh, well, fuck it. Yeah, unfortunately the KOs fucked me, didn't they? One out of six. One out of six KOs is not what you need when you're down TV against uh, Pupok with Chaos Dwarves. I mean, Blitz doesn't even help me now. I, sh I should have just hit him with Mighty Blow. Nah, I'm just fucked. I mean, the team isn't fucked, so it's all right. There's no perm. Still got two, still got two apples. It's like losing a game isn't the end of the world. 13-2-2 uh, two, two is absolutely fine. So... Yeah. Just hope good guys don't die.
Maybe I should have set up right at the back, actually. Probably should have done. Like the Camry game. Yeah, I should have tried to kill his claw upon that. That was bad. <laughs> to get more fucked as the kickoff result. Oh well. Dice of the dice, aren't we? Needed to get lucky. Much like the KLZE game. Needed to get lucky. Um, this time didn't. with good players. No, it's not that desperate. I mean, I'll still hold out the hope of winning, you know. I'll always hold out the hope of winning, no matter how small it may be. I don't know if I was muted then or not, but hopefully I was. I guess with a bribe I can just foul anyone, can't I? Oh, half a chance, half a chance. Problem is, if I foul now, it, it gives up the drive completely. Like it's already nearly fucking given up as, as bad as it is. I guess he can't hand off. It's a deep kick. Maybe I'll just go for a foul here. Fuck it. Five, seven versus three, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, he is very, he is very far back here. Yeah, that's the thing.
It's all caps now, uh, Hippie. Just should work. It just sh it should just work on deads, shouldn't it? Fucking apple, man. Save it the whole fucking game instead of using it on KOs to win. And what do you get? Just fucked up. No, it's not the first dead at all. No, but it was, it was a fucking good play, wasn't it? <laughs> oh, fun fucks. Bolt, Blitz, Recover? Mm, not really. I mean, could just go for one D's, but that seems lame. <laughs> Idiotic foul. <laughs> uh, yeah, Donald Thumb, not Donald Trump. Get it right, Maddo. <laughs> Thanks, old Palmer. <laughs> Oh man, Maggie Thrasher makes a foul, gets killed. <laughs> Classic. Five versus eight, not looking so good now, is it? I think I bolt here, and then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, GFI, pass, potato, win. Why not try a chaos team? <laughs> pass it to him, then fuck off. Or maybe. himself. He could blitz him and then he could go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, GFI, GFI. I think the fact he can go there is pretty good, isn't it? Three, six, seven, eight, nine. He can do all the GFIs to reach him. But I think this is the play. Low odds. But I'm gonna go for it. Stand up dudes first. No, I was going to dodge away with him and stuff. Potentially blitz. He was going to potentially blitz here. And then base. I guess I could have stood him up to get claw mighty blowed. But, um, no. <laughs> oh my 
my god! <laughs> well, he should have done some safe moves first, shouldn't he? Holy shit! Holy shit! This is probably just safe, isn't it? Ish. He could go there. One, two, three, Get four, five, fuck. six, seven. Get birded, you fuck. <laughs> Absolutely. Oh, yeah. Oh, God. These birds, though, something else, aren't they? He could dodge and then he could blitz. Rock hard today. So nah, dodge, rock. dodge gets into there, doesn't it? Which? Hmm. Double GFI would get him safe from that hit. Then there'd only be this one to worry about. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine. I could do a dodge there. Let's do a GFI to here. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six. Does he have to double GFI? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, I think he's got a double GFI. One, two, three, four, five, six. He can't reach. One, two, three, four, five, six. He can't blitz. Guess I've got to reroll now. You only need one. One, two. Yeah, I just need one GFI. And he can do something. Wow, look at look at Cyanide giving you a crazy pathing. And then a re-roll for the dodge next turn. And it should be okay. <laughs> Fucking breath. I mean, they do have movement, don't they? Um, but I mean, he did quad skull. But even if he hadn't quadded skull, if I had made the 55% pass, I would have been away. Anyway, Wizard is pretty good, isn't it, sometimes? I'm mean, incredibly lucky that he... He did play bad, didn't he? Oh, he can go around that way. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. This is quite a good move, though. The end block we trust. Now, I've, now I've got to dodge with him, haven't I? Yeah, the GFI was a good move. He's got to blitz him, push him to there, and then. So it is a three plus, effectively, to score. Mm. 
Now wait a minute, can I, can I actually, uh, stall? <laughs> if I pushed him the other way, I might have been able to stall there, might I? But no, let's not. <laughs> Don't fucking stall. <laughs> No, I might have been able to had I uh, had I planned it out. If I'd handed off the blood stepper last turn, I would have I would have been able to try to stall. I think I thought about going for the hand off the blood stepper last turn. Come on, chaos back. Yes. Oh, oh, oh. All right, got a, got a team again. Okay, now. How many's he got? Two, four, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. He's got ten. But uh nine, that's like a team, isn't it? Still got a reroll. Hail ducky full of dice, Nuffle is with thee. Blessed is our monk coaches, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jimmy. Holy ducky mother of pals, pray for us birds now and at the outpo of our death. Amen. <laughs> Thanks very much. <laughs> oh dear. Told her. Thank you. Right, he's just a dodger now, isn't he? Isn't that then uh, you've got to fucking suck it up. Stop bitching like a little baby. And try and fucking play better. Eh? Old Jim would be M, but I'm new Jim. I'm new Jim, so I don't do that. Like, I don't want to give him free space to go forward, but I do want to be able to react, don't I? Um, unfortunately, the uh, the guard mighty blow guy, guard mighty blow tackle guy. A little bit. A little bit sad. Um. I do still have a bribe, yeah. Maybe it's, a, it's unlikely to be relevant. <laughs> but yeah, it is a thing. I mean, you might still get the score. You might, and the only one re-roll. But at least, hopefully this time I'll remember he's got three turns. Holy shit. That was amazing, wasn't it? I mean... You know, I didn't get a lot of luck leading up to it, but him one in one in twelve nine sixing with a ball, <laughs> and then uh, and then one in eighty oneing with the ball was pretty good, wasn't it? But he did misplay. Like although he rolled a one in twelve nine six with a ball. He did misplay, didn't he? Because he should have he should have made it safer. Now, obviously, you you only get punished for it one in twelve nine six times, so it's something that everyone does. I'm certainly not I'm not knocking Pupok for for making that misplay because it's just a misplay everyone makes because they're like, I won't quad skull. I'll just do this blitz. I mean, maybe he maybe he did go wrong because he was trying to power me, wasn't he? Oh no, he wasn't. He just needed a push. He just needed to push me, didn't he? I think. So no, so it was it, you know he he thinks he just needs a push, so he's not going to care about it, is he? Something most people would do. I think. Certainly the kind of mistake that I do all the time. <laughs> oh good, this is going well, isn't it? Oh, at least that apple worked. Fucking Corbin, he's made of paper, isn't he? At least the apple fucking worked this time. Come 
Yeah, Corbin did die yesterday, yeah. It's stupid, isn't it? I mean, as, as rowdy as Chaos are, to have made three Kaz from five... You know, three kills from five Kaz is ridiculous. And one was a double Kaz because the Apple failed. So he's made three Kaz from five... So effectively, he's made four Kaz... Uh, four deaths from six six Kaz rolls, which is just crazy dice. So as scary as the team is, it's not really to do with with them being scary. It's just stupid dice, isn't it? You know, it's going to happen. The apple failed on the other one, Wormthrax. It, so it was a, it was a death. So it was a one in three, uh, more or less, for a death. Um, do I uphill him with wrestle to go through for a two D on the ball? One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, G of five. I think I do. I, I, I don't hate this play. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, G of five, G of five. Uphill him. All right, I'm game. I'm game if you are, Pupok. The apple saved one of them. I mean, minor strength is death. You know? Oh, yes, don't mind if I do. Oh, good. Oh, I should have just gone here, shouldn't I? Why not throw it? Because I've got it on a bloodstepper. I could have fully screened if I hadn't put him in there. <laughs> He's got the canoring threat, yeah. Should have double GFI'd that guy to here, because now I can 2D him. <laughs> Glorious. Get banged on. Glorious. Glorious. <laughs> 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 
Yeah, I mean, it was really harsh. To, I mean, look, it was really harsh to call the not preparing for a, a, a quad skull a mistake. Because it is a mistake that everybody routinely makes. But it was a mistake, wasn't it? And yeah, he should have protected the ball better there, shouldn't he? Because I, I had the uphill for the uh, the sack. So... And I mean, look, a quad skull sounds horrific, but I would have made that pass 55% of the time, and then it would have been a more genuine bolt steal, wouldn't it? 3-1 win, team dead, restart. Thanks, man. Yeah. Gonna lose the team to Woodies, yeah. <laughs> yeah, the quad score probably tilted him a bit as well. Like, you know. Oh, yeah, for sure. 100% <laughs> worm threat. Uh, the one in twelve nine six is because it was thirty six times thirty six. He hit with his block block bull centaur, so one in thirty six a double skull, because you know six sided dice six times six thirty six. Then he used a team reroll, um, so therefore thirty six times thirty six one in twelve nine six. Yeah, you can't compare one in two and one twelve nine six. Well, no, the point is you'd have still been fucked if I made my one in two necropotence. That's what I'm saying. You know, that's what I'm saying. If if I just made my pass, he'd have been fucked. So that's all I'm trying to say. I'm not. I'm not saying that I was as lucky. I was unlucky as he was. But um, God, it's pretty good, wasn't it? Yeah, it was a shame about the blocker. It was only one death in the end. Yeah, uh, because the peasants don't fucking matter. <laughs> the peasants, the peasants don't matter a fuck. So it was really only one death in the end. Although it technically was a lot of deaths. So yeah, got out of it quite lightly, really. Um, two kills. Yeah. But kind of four. He kind of, ro he kind of rolled four kills. Um, which, you know... That, and that's the thing, you know, people overestimate how Killy... Chaos teams are and, and, and Chorf teams because even if the has your entire team, you know, 12 players, statistically, that's only about three of them are going to be dead. Um, you know, so yeah, you know, it's, it just comes down to dice. At the end of the day, stuff like teams dying from, from perms just comes out of the, the rolls of the dice. There's, you know, obviously the fact that Chaos make more cars and Chaos Dwarves make more cars ma makes them more likely to do it. But really, ending a team like that is just uh, is just more random than anything else. Uh, should Donald Thump replace Opama as the uh, as the <laughs> as the um, wrestle? I guess he should. God, that actually looks like him. <laughs> Donald Thumb. <laughs> that actually looks to him. Um, yeah. Yeah, like, do you know what I mean? Though? It's like, um... People people make a big deal about how dead your team is, and while yes, you you know it, it can make the team make the game incredibly difficult and everything. Um, make it, it can yeah, ten k away from going straight back up. So I guess I'll just have a journeyman here. Um, yeah, look. It's just that I'm just saying that the chance of getting your team killed in any given match is grossly overestimated. That's all I'm saying, you know. Um, but obviously, the chance of you having a not very fun game and getting loads of players cast is very high. 
<laughs> you know, you know, like th there's a good chance of taking five or six or seven cars, but the chance of then out of those five or six or seven cars losing multiple vital players is 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 unlikely. You know, it really is. It really is unlikely. So so you know, you can consider yourself unlucky if you lose a few players like that. Um, no, I'm not going to. I'm going to keep journeyman for the next game and then and then get two at once to go up to twelve because you know peasants die pretty easily. But that was an insane match, wasn't it? I can't even believe that I won that. I mean, I thought for sure I was gonna gonna lose or maybe draw, but um, there you go. I thought draw at best, but it was just insanity in the end, wasn't it? So thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and stay fantastic.